Alright, so this is going to be take two with the uh, audio on. Um, I already did this part once and just figured out that I didn't have my audio on. So anyhow, um, I'm getting ready to stain uh, my first birdhouse that's been bought by one of my subscribers. Um, Amelda Martinez, uh, Charlie is what she goes by wanted a uh, cardinal birdhouse and so I looked it up and this is a birdhouse for a cardinal I actually the hinges on this I used um, wood dowels so it's all wood other than the nails that are in it it's pretty tight on the front the screw will hold it together so nothing can um, pry it open I've got um, air vent holes on both sides for each. It actually has airflow up on the front um, and drain holes on the bottom. I've already sanded this thing down and if you're wondering why am I wearing gloves, I'm getting ready to stain it so that it can dry and I can ship it to Charlie. And right now um, I'm debating on what color to stain it. I also have a birdhouse I built the other day. I already showed it on a video. I didn't like how the roof came out. It, it just, the angles were, were horrible on it. Um, I'm still trying to get back into the whole angle thing. Um, but I've redone this birdhouse, the roof. It looks a whole lot better. I don't know if that shows up on the video, but um, it's, it's, a whole lot better it's not going to leak um, both sides are held together with four screws and the uh, top piece of wood um, I guess you'd call it the ridge cap um, I've got two screws in here as well and then the uh, the eyelets to hang it with a string um, so this I'm going to stain first because I'm, I'm, I'm just not sure what color I really want to stain this other birdhouse for a cardinal uh, but Charlie wanted it stained. So I'm gonna stain it. Um, this one, um, I think I said already, it's for a uh, Carolina wren or a Carolina chickadee. Um, it's got a hole, uh, the hole is smaller on this one than it is on the cardinal uh, birdhouse. Each birdhouse, they're kind of similar but different. Um, the hole placement, the hole diameter, um, the uh, depth and height of the birdhouse, um, birds like them to be a specific way. But um, anyhow, I'll go ahead, um, I'm just rambling on now I guess, and I'll, I'll get to the point, I guess, I'll get to the point of the video and I'll start staining these two. That's why, like I said, I'm wearing gloves, um, I'm using old t-shirt pieces for my rags, uh, my wife has a uh, t-shirt business she does uh, and t-shirts that don't turn out the right way or that are sent here that are uh, not put together very well um, I go ahead and use them for staining things I want to stain or working on vehicles so anyhow I'll go ahead and I will begin working on this little project and um, if anybody is interested, I'll I'll uh, I'll leave a link to where you can find these plans if you want to try it yourself. Um, I'm not a how-to channel. I'm not a you know anything like that. I'm no expert on woodworking or putting birdhouses together or birds for that matter. Um, I'm learning a lot about birds by putting birdhouses together. So. And I've just started selling birdhouses. Um, if you're wanting a birdhouse, I can build you one. 
Um, let me know. You can send me a, an email. I'll have my email uh, address in the description area as well as, like I said, um, where I get the plans for these birdhouses. I'll put that in the description area as well. So let me go ahead without further ado. I will take a drink of coffee and for John Null, Channel Zero, holy crap, this is good coffee. Um, I couldn't resist. It's not the coffee that he was getting when he was saying that, but I like coffee, so it's good coffee. All right, we'll go ahead and get started. So it's not completed, done yet. Um, I've got to stain the bottom and the door, the front of the door. Everything else is pretty much done. Uh, I'm gonna let it dry here for a few. And this one, I was able to hang up and finish it off. I think, I think it turned out pretty good. And I'll, I'll usually stain the whole area, um, but I don't stain inside of the, uh, I, don't, I don't stain the inside. I don't touch the inside of the birdhouse. Um, I don't think typically that they do that. Um, I haven't taken any store-bought birdhouses apart and looked, but the way this one looks inside is the way it's going to look. I'm not going to... Um, I don't want to put anything inside that could be toxic um, to the birds or to to the uh, chicks that they 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 have inside. So. 